All right, so to block your bloatware and all the other nonsense that they put on your device that you don't really want or use that just wastes battery and collects data on you, you need an app blocker. And in order to get this one to work, you need to remove all of your accounts from your device first. So you basically go to user accounts. I removed all mine. This is where you do it. Next thing you do is you go to turn on developer options. You go to settings, you go to about tablet, and then you just click on the build number seven times or five times. I don't remember. I'm already a developer option. I already have it enabled. So let's go there and we go to developer options. Now, what you need to do is turn on USB debugging and you do that right here. And you're basically going to allow it to talk to your computer. So we have to install minimal ADB on the computer. I'll put a link in the description. Always make sure to read these that they're not installing something. Sometimes they try to trick you and install something. If you just click, keep clicking next. All right, it's installed. Now we need to connect the laptop or desktop to the tablet or phone. And then you type in OK. All right, so we got this error. And basically, it's not allowing the two devices to talk to each other. So what you have to do is click OK, and you're allowing your computer to push through stuff onto your tablet or phone. So watch, when we type it in again, it should say device. Once you see that, copy and paste the command. I emailed you. And now you're done. So now unplug from the device. And what you're going to do is restart your tablet. And then put all your apps back in. All right, so let's see if it worked. We will disable Amazon Alexa. So we go into App Freezer. No problem. Hit OK. Perfect. This is not a big deal. This is not a big deal. Let's go to Install Apps. Let's go to Amazon Alexa, we freeze it, and now, let's see, it's gone. So Amazon Alexa is now frozen. All right, but listen, you're not done. You need to restart the device, reinstall all of your user accounts, and any of the ones that gave you a hard time, like WhatsApp or Outlook or whatever it is, you need to reinstall those apps as well. All right, man, take it easy.